Hey girl, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have my Sephora haul. Woo, woo, woo. This is the only time of year that I could justify the spending that I did on my Sephora. I actually have been saving up, but you guys, I got so many good things. And I want to share with you guys, not one bag, not two bags, but three. Okay, so let's get into it. Um, let's start off with this viral brush from, from Patrick Ta. So this is the sculpting one, the sculpting brush. And I thought it's brilliant. I think it's brilliant. I used it today. So you just go in with your bronzer and you sta a staple, staple, staple. And girl, it's a dream. You can bring it all the way down. I love this. So I think that this one is worth your money. Okay, the Patrick Ta one. Now, I've been in a berry type of punch of a blush. If you guys didn't know, I am a lover of blush. So yeah, I splurge on the butt, on the blushes. But I picked up this Mario, and this is a cream blush in the, in the shade Berry Punch, mira. This one is perfect for winter, you guys. So you, you know, it just looks like, mira. I thought about using this the same way uh, Patrick Ta uses a blush where you put the powder first and then you put the green, the cream since they, the berry uh, Patrick Ta's were sold out. I ended up purchasing from Maybelline or Revlon, the viral, the pink ones and the pink packaging. It's beautiful, you guys. So you just put it right here and ju it just looks like you're cold. Okay. Oh, you, it looks so beautiful. The Laneige. Of course, I cannot not pat i could not not get it it's very good for the value it comes with one two three four five the little brush i've had mine and it's lasted for about six months but everybody the reason why i picked up is because everybody uses my lip mask so i was like mine as well yeah tu sabes mine is sugar face polish and i don't know what to think about this okay i still have to try it out i don't like the fact that I have to leave it on my skin for five to 10 minutes, but it smells amazing and it's a face polish. So if you have oily skin, I don't know, because it does leave like a residue on your skin. I've used it. You live, you leave it five or 10 minutes and yeah, I, mean, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know about this one. It smells really nice. It smells kind of citrusy and, and brown sugary. It smells really nice, pero, I don't know. I don't know if I would repurchase it. Yeah, it was about that time for the skincare to re up on everything. The one that I use is guava. Uh, and that one has cleared up my face in such a dramatic way. It's made my skin a, a, a same tone. It's made it so beautiful. But I think that this one is it's for smoothing and making my face super even. And I really believe in these products because they have changed my face, but like I said, I use the guava. This is the strawberry one, so hopefully I don't go into a breakout. And what is this actually? This is a serum, a strawberry pore smooth blur drop serum. Mm, okay, and it comes with this one, and this is from NARS. I've already used it. My favorite NARS blush was from Orgasm. It's it, orgasm x okay but i've been eyeing orgasm the original so i thought that this was a great way to try the orgasm x the orgasm and it comes with another one but the formula is not the same at least i don't think it's the same so let's go ahead and try it out this is the orgasm x and I just remember that my Orgasm X used to be more smoother, more creamier. I don't know if I have to like break the barrier of the top. This is Orgasm. So you see it's, they're like, it's not the same formula, but I still have to play with it. And it comes with this one too. This is um, Orgasm Rush and this is Swinger. So it's, wait, yeah. Swinger, Orgasm X, Orgasm an orgasm rush <laughs> okay um i'm so i'm i'm a little iffy on that so everybody says that this is super good the nars and this is the travel little packet 
So it's a liquid blush for orgasm and it looks like this. I was about to pick up the ones that comes with like the three and stuff like that, but I didn't. So I picked this one up. Let's put it right here. Oh, that's such a beautiful color. I have used it, but I'm still iffy on it as well. I'm just like, I don't know. See, I like a punch in my face. Like I like a, a bright blush on my face. I like my face to look juicy and to look, um, I don't know. But these are very mellow. And it comes with this one too, which the baby got, my, I have a one-year-old and she loves getting into my makeup and she got into my makeup, okay? But this one's orgasm as well. It's shimmery. One thing that I did notice is that, that it picks up on my texture right here is what worked so well on my skin to brighten it up and to get rid of all the, you know, the the spots that I had, CEO uh, Sunday Riley and vitamin C. But I wanted to try something else because your skin does get used to the same products. So I've had Tatcha before, I've had this, and I remember having a breakout. Um, but I ended up picking it out again because you know, winter and fall is here and dry skin and all that. This just feels amazing on my skin. I hope it doesn't break me out again. I don't know if I got a breakout because I was going through hormonal changes. And I think that my hormones have been under control. So hopefully uh, my skin accepts the Tatcha again because I used up a sample that I had. And oh my God, the way it made my skin feel feel was amazing. This is a product I've been wanting to pick up for two years and then I never pick it up. I always leave it. I'm just like, no girl. But this is the NARS and this is Laguna Bronzing Cream. I just received this right now. I'm just like, man, it would have, I wish it would have came sooner so I could have done my face with this. Okay. But NARS Laguna, like, can you go wrong with any NARS Laguna? And it looks like this, mira. Oh, such a beautiful. Nars's packaging is so beautiful, don't you think? But it looks like this. I think this is a beautiful shade. The one I'm wearing right now is from Patrick Ta, and I really like it. It's called She Sculpted, I think. But yeah, I wanted to pick this one up and try it out. I think it's a beautiful shade. Ooh, look at this one. This is Huda Beauty. And this is the Easy Bake and Snatch. So I tried it out today. How do you think? I, I think it blurs out your face. What do you think? I'm just like, Grr. So I got rid of my, I, got, I didn't get rid of, I finished my banana powder. So I picked this one up in banana. And yeah, right on time, okay? So Grr. this is good. The Easy Bake. Itch. it's good so whoa oh okay it comes with a little puff look at that right for the inner right here oh i, di I didn't use it because i got my little brush and i was just like Grr. i hope you know that i don't use no filters on my camera okay i actually film on my phone so i am 37 years old and yo girl, I have no Botox, I have no fillers, I have nothing. As far as I've gone is do, uh, doing my lips, which I wanna do my lips again, and that's it. Um, yeah, so I think it looks good. What do you guys think? I just had to throw that out there, okay? Um, I film with my phone, and you know these iPhone 15s pick up on every little thing wrinkle every little texture everything that you have in your face that you don't want to show it will show okay so yeah but i think my makeup look it looks flawless today okay i ended up picking up this ysl uh rouge volup candy glaze and showcasing nude what's the color is it is it what's the color candy glaze uh showcasing nude is this showcasing you? I don't know, lost it. But it looks like this, and that's what I have on. I have this on, but on top I have an uh I have another gloss, but this is the shade. 
I heard my babies wake up. I'm like, are they going to come in right now? Because I put them to sleep. But look at that color. Oh, it's so cute. Let's see. I mean, it's cute. I still have to try it out, but I see that these are very viral and I'm happy to have it in my collection. I'm actually happy and grateful that I have everything that I got, you know? I am. So, y'all, oh my goodness. Let me just tell you something, okay? If you want to invest in a great uh, blush, I would suggest that you get your, your hands on Patrick Ta because their blushes are out of this... His blushes are out of this world. They're perfectly made. They're just, you know what? He's becoming one of my favorite um, makeup lines. Like, blah, blah. you good, you good, okay? So anyways, I got this in the shade. Um, She's that girl. I saw him doing the makeup tutorial for Carol G., and when I saw her makeup, I didn't even know that he had done her makeup. But when I saw pictures of her, uh, I was like, oh, my God, her makeup is just flawless. OK, flawless. And I really like that makeup look she she had on. So he used this on her. Obviously, you, you can see that I use this today. But I put it I put the blush on first and then I put the cream just just in awe like girl. No like damn you know what imagine one day patrick todd does my makeup i can only imagine wow this is not from the sephora cell but i do want to share what brushes i got from tiktok it's not from the sephora just hold hold okay go on tiktok and then look for these type of brushes so i just have to share them just you know so I didn't pick up no expensive brushes other than the Patrick Ta, but these were affordable. So this is for your under eye, aquí, mira, right here. This one was for my foundation. And I, what I like about these is that they're angled, okay? So I got these, mira, I got these from TikTok and this one too for my blush. So these are BK Beauty. Yeah, BK Beauty. So look at BK Beauty for these type of brushes that they're super uh, popular at this moment because they're angled and bitch, it is very different. So it does apply your makeup in such a phenomenal, beautiful way. All right, I picked up my Tower 28 uh, concealer and I got this in the shade 9.0 um, MDR. I don't know, 9.0. I don't know if it works on me. I've heard great things about this blood this uh concealer but i just don't know if it's gonna fit my oh it looks uh, it looks promising okay i'm finishing up my favorite concealer is actually nars um so i'm finishing that one up and i think this is close to the color let's see does it look mm, i don't know i'm gonna try on my makeup with you guys what do you think you guys what do you guys want to see that i just have so many goodies i'm just i'm i feel like i'm rushing but okay Benetint, this is a refill for me because my baby, my one-year-old, she threw it all away, okay? But I've been really, 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 for those type of days that you just want a blush and lip, that's what I have on, in the center of my lip, and then I put it on top. I put this on top. For those days that you don't really want to wear makeup, but you do, Benetint, is the way mi amor okay benefit it's the way i feel i refilled on my sunscreen this is the only sunscreen in the entire world <laughs> this is the only sunscreen that actually hasn't broken me out and this is glow recipe the spf 50 okay i was in desperate need of it because i'm almost done the collection, the collection, the, the collection of my Armani blushes are, is becoming a real thing, okay? And this is in the shade 61 Desire. So I had no color this color. I had no blush. I have no blush this color. And yeah, mira, let me show you. Look at that. A berry kind of dusty pink like what? 
I love their formula. I have plant, I have two, I think, of Armani, and I use them all the time. And this is not going to be no exception because this dusty pink, hermoso, precioso, fabuloso. Um, I picked up this Anastasia. Okay. Gel what is it called um eyebrow gel it's changed my eyebrows it's changed it like what was i doing before it but uh yeah i really like it and i said i i really recommend this product i think it's really good it's one of the best ones that i've used so far for my eyebrows mira I had in my cart the the ones that came with the black and the white and then their most popular makeup forever lip liners and stuff like that and it got sold out the same day that I was gonna the same day that Sephora went on went live for the 20 30 40 50 percent rouge whatever <laughs> for their sale what am I saying um it was sold out so i had to pick up a make makeup forever liner since you guys love it i wanted to see what the hype was about and that's what i have on my lips the hyaluronic acid the two percent from the ordinary you guys this works magic i recommend that if you're in your 30s even in your 20s just use these stuff start using products for your face and you know it's a game changer so this is a very thick it's very thick, mira. Okay, and it works, it works. This is a pomade in a pencil by Too Faced. It's brand new, it was brand new. And I have been liking it. So I didn't pick it up in the Sephora sale, but I suggest that if you are still shopping for Sephora or whatever, pick this up. It works really good. Although the pencil, it's thick, okay? This is a thick pencil, but you guys, I like, I've been liking how it leaves my eyebrows. In case, you know, you wanna try something new for your eyebrows, this, it comes with the spoolie on the back and it comes with this, mira. So it's this type. You see how it's thick and then thin? It's this type of, um, I got it in the shade black. I think it was soft black. Yeah, in the shade safe, soft black. Let's see. Me not lying. Yeah, soft black. <laughs> I'm like, me not lying. Okay, and last, but last but not least, a refill. Why? Because mi bebecita, she, she, I don't know what she did to it, you guys, but she did something real bad to my highlighter. When I saw my highlighter, it was completely empty and I was like, Grr! so, okay. Rare Beauty in the shade Exhilarate highlighter. And it looks like this. I use it today. I mean, your girl is glowing. I don't know if I'm glowing so good. Like I really like my makeup look today. Um, I ordered the Mario... I I ordered the I the what is it called? Ethereal eye, something like that. So I'm excited to receive that. I barely put in the order yesterday, so it's gonna take some time to come. And you guys, the only fragrance, can you believe the only fragrance I ordered? And yeah, my channel is about fragrances, but I only ordered one fragrance, and that was Ching, 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 missing person. Oh my goodness. I have gone to Sephora and I've sprayed it and I sprayed everything I've wanted to try. I have sprayed it and I have Sephora like right in the corner of my house. It's like, like five minutes, less than five minutes away. So I go there and I spray and I'm just like, it's not, it's like, it's not enough. You know, it's not something that I want to put in my collection, but I sp sprayed missing person and it was the most softest fluffiest unique skin scent not skin scent it's not like uh juliet has a gun it's not like that it's not like dossier uh glossier i'm sorry you it's similar it's in that same vibe but there was something sugary something fluffy of that fragrance that i had nothing in my collection so i was like girl 
you come in with home. You, you come in with me, baby. So you guys, that is going to be the end of this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed my haul. And what did you guys pick up? What are you guys excited to use? I'm, I, I, I can't wait to spray on my missing person fragrance, but yeah. So please like, comment, subscribe, y'all. See you on the next one. Besitos, sat.